The CH2M Fairhurst Joint Venture is responsible for the design and construction supervision of the upgrade of 47 kilometers of the A9 from single to dual carriageway in Scotland, UK, to be completed by 2025. With such a large project, there are many options and many stakeholders that the team needed to bring to the table to incorporate their concerns, communicate design plans, and get buy-in from both government agencies and nearby residents. Christoph Siaka, a senior engineer at CH2M, describes how Bentley Luminar T and context capture software helped them to successfully overcome this challenge. The Luminar T and the context capture, which allow us to better communicate, better present our projects as a 3D model rather than the drawings and um, engineering 3D model. Uh, it allows us to, to make it real uh, nice images, uh, good looking, and uh, it allows people to understand better projects rather than uh, figuring out the um, project design from the 2D drawings and the raw 3D uh, engineering software. In our engineering software, we've got uh, raw data, which is uh, polygons, meshes without textures, only colors, and it, 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 doesn't, it doesn't show the uh, environment. Uh, it, it, it doesn't make it real. That's why we're using Reality Mesh, because when you look at the Reality Mesh, uh, which is a high resolution one, it's, it's, you, feel, you have a feeling this is the, this is the reality, this is, this, is the, this is real. And if you combine it with your design model and, and apply textures, cars, moving cars, and uh, trees, uh, environment elements, uh, which are already in the environment, people just have a feeling that they are, they are there. This is this is I know this I know this view I, I'm I'm living here uh, I know this is the this is this is location and uh, they can orientate in a uh, um, in, in space uh, more easily they, they they can recognize the project and uh, the, the environment more easily so it's it's easier for them to uh, to to understand project uh, looking at the high quality uh, live cube exp uh, in in laminar T as a uh, virtual as a reality model as a 3d model rather than looking at the uh, engineering design because they, they they don't understand it it's going to be there we're going to have a, a lot of questions what's happening here we can we can explain it more visually in laminar T uh, there's going to be definitely uh, wider use of uh, laminar T, but the future is happening now. We are already using it on a, uh, different other projects. Uh, uh, one of the projects is, uh, is happening uh, at the same time as our um, A9 project, and we already created a live cube, which is 100 square kilometer uh, area. And, and we've got another project, which was really uh, time constrained. And within the and with the laminar T capabilities, we were able to create a uh, really nice, good-looking uh, animation and a visualization within a couple of days. Uh, and I know the other people from uh, our company that they just asking me uh, about the laminar T, and they also want to use it. And uh, so the, the future is happening now.